Hey, it's Chris with The Verge, and we are here with a couple near-future technologies from BMW. This is a, uh, a tablet designed in cooperation with Samsung uh, that is custom. It looks like a standard Android tablet, but it's not. If you press the home button, it, it goes to this BMW screen, and that's because it's designed to stay put, to dock in the back. So for instance, you can adjust the seats, you can change the air conditioning and the heating, uh, you can change the radio station or the media for both uh, the right and left passengers, uh, you can find out when you're going to get to where it is that you're going, and so on. Um, but it is still an Android tablet. If you press apps here, you'll end up back out at a standard Android home screen. So this isn't available yet, but it'll be launching in the next year or two. And then we have next generation iDrive. Now BMW has been using iDrive for quite some time, but this is what it's going to look like in the next couple of years. In addition to the standard iDrive controller next to the driver, you can also touch the screen to do different functions, and you can use gesture controls. There are four different gestures that you can program to activate different functions of the system, which is really cool. There's a camera in the roof of the car that detects your hand movements and lets you do different things. You can change the volume, you can answer calls, you can reject calls, uh, you can turn the display on and off, and again, they're programmable, so you can set them to do different things. And that's it from BMW here at CES. For more, check out The Verge on YouTube.